So welcome back everyone and let's start talking about match week 2 uh, The first two games at least of match week 2 of the Indian Super League And let's start talking with uh, the first game of the, this match week 2 And the team that right now is leading the standings Even though, yeah, I mean it's a little bit too early to talk about leaders uh, but they are right now they are uh, with uh, two games two wins three wins if you count the AFC Cup win against uh, Odisha and Yeah, I mean that's how you want to start the season and Mohun absolutely did it uh, the first half uh, It was pretty balanced the first I would say 15 20 minutes Bengaluru was probably a little bit better than Mohun started to rise up uh, the end of the first half it was scoreless during the second half uh, Mohun Bagan started to push again and at the 67th minute there is a ball that comes to Cummings Cummings is really really good on not shooting making basically a little fake giving the ball to Bomus that was inside the area and Bomus doesn't miss and he scores so at the, uh, the 67th minute uh, Mohun Bagan is in front Bengalura at that point needs to uh, uncover a little bit needs to uh, try everything possible to tie the game but Mohun Bagan is very really good on counter-attacking as well and uh, this basically it's what it's what ends the game because they don't score Mohun Bagan doesn't score with these counter-attacks but they uh, basically uh, put the defenders of Bengaluru in a difficult situation and we, ha and we see two ejections because of that at the 75th minute we, uh, Wang Jia gets ejected and then 92nd minute uh, Roshan Singh gets ejected as well because of uh, um, a foul on a counter-attack that otherwise Mahmoud Bagan would have had a great opportunity to score and yeah, Mumbagan go go up to six points. They are first in the standings right now. Even though a uh, lot of teams need uh, to play, uh, still need to play. And I mean, it's just match week two. Um, uh, but you don't wanna you wanna start like this, and you, you don't wanna start like Bengaluru. Bengaluru, um, I mean, second loss in two games. Uh, that's a bad start if there is one. At zero points, uh, we see how the the season is gonna develop. Uh, but yeah, that's not great. That's what, that's not where you wanna be uh, at the beginning of the season. And yeah, uh, we see what's going to happen. Um, let's talk. I mean, we have to say that Bengaluru faced Mohun and Kerala Blasters, two teams that uh, are looking good and uh, they have high high expectations for this season so we have to count that on this analysis then let's talk about the game uh today's game uh, today that i'm recording odisha against mumbai city fc and uh, the game in the first half is like every game is basically uh, until now in the indian super league is balanced in the beginning of the first half but then uh, when the game seemed like um, ending on a scoreless first half there is a horrible mistake by between the defender and the goalkeeper from Mumbai City FC I don't know who has the majority of the guilt on this but anyways uh, basically the goalkeeper grabs the ball but there is the defender there so he basically uh, put like leaves the ball from his hands it didn't it didn't hold it up anyways jerry was there he gets the ball and he scores the easiest goal in his career probably at the 46th minute putting odisha ahead and scoring in two consecutive games um during the second half mumbai city as soon as the second half start they start to push and they found they find immediately back to off the net with a header by griffiths on a corner by stewart uh, they tie the game, they try to push to find the advantage but it's Odisha that finds a penalty and Krishna scores it. A penalty kick at the 76 minute puts Odisha back into the top, seems everything ready for a second consecutive win for Odisha but uh, we have another player that scores in his second consecutive game, this time is Pereira Diaz that scores at the 88th minute on a, a cross by Vikram Singh he scores he shows that he's a great scorer and uh, yeah Mumbai City 
uh, get a draw. Perhaps they ho were hoping for a win, but that's a really great, great point. And uh, that's a point gained, and that's and these are probably two points lost by Odisha. Um, yeah, I mean Pereira Diaz, absolutely great. Jerry also like yes, easy goal, but you need to be there to score that. You need to be positioned well. You need to be uh, always focused and careful. So that's that's all uh, always something that you have to count on. And yeah, uh, two great scores, two great games to start this match week two. Match week two that is going to continue tomorrow with Northeast United against Chennai. Uh, and then uh, we have the day after that East Bengal club against Iberdabad, the day after that Kerala Blasters against Shyam Shiptpur, and the day after that FC Go against Punjab FC. I'm gonna make a review uh, for each two games, so we're gonna see uh, a review for these two games and then uh, a review for these other two games and probably I'm gonna keep going like this. And I don't know if I'm gonna make a full review of Metric 2 at the end. I may do it, I may not, I don't know, I'm gonna see. Anyways, that's pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you like it, please consider putting a like, consider subscribing, and I hope to see you all very, very soon. Thank you very much.